What we wanted is to uh, explore what could we do with an emerging uh, new technology, the quadcopters here, and give it some meaning, give it some magic, and bring it to another level. We have been doing research with fly machines for over 15 years. Using algorithms that we've developed, we can dynamically control a large number of flying machines with great precision, do things that would be impossible to do with human pilots. We saw right away that there was a potential with quadrocopters to explore where else could we go and what type of interaction could they have with humans. We have synchronized groups of flying machines to music, have built structures with ropes and bricks in front of live audiences, performed various balancing acts, and even explored human flying machine juggling. What's fun is to imagine what else could we uh, put on them to make them fly and is it possible to make the quadcopters disappear. So we did a number of tests. We came up with all kinds of ideas. We, we even had, you know, uh, flying heads to see, you know, what kind of effect it, it, could, uh, it could create. You know, we felt, you know, there was uh, two elements. At first, we thought it was really interesting to put lights on the quadcopters. And then at some point, almost by accident, some of our colleagues just, you know, joking and, and talking about lampshade. And I just, that made me stop in my tracks and I thought, wait a minute, did you say lampshade? Well, that could be really interesting. What if we had a number of lampshades starting to fly? And that was really the, the nucleus of the idea of creating this workshop of flying lampshades. We had a great time co-evolving the script with the capabilities of the flying lampshades. We created choreographies with the intent of invoking intimacy, wonder, playfulness, and grace. It's easy to start to give them a personality. Each of the quadcopters that you see in the film, they actually have a name, a personality, and even uh, some element of motivations. Is there a future for this in the performing arts? Absolutely. We're just getting started. Three, two, one, go!